assalamu alaikum in this video i am going to do the continuation of uh, adding and subtraction of polynomials and for the addition we have done already in the previous video uh, in this very video we are going to discuss only the subtraction and the different method to do uh, the subtraction so let's start okay so i have a, a question an example for you over here written in this uh, subtraction method we just have to focus on the terms as uh, we have done already in the addition manner but over here it there is a little bit difference which make the whole scenario different this from word you have to keep in mind that there is a word written from if we say subtract 10 from 40 let's uh, do the example so you will do definitely 40 minus 10 what you have written first this 40 which is written just after the word uh, from so here as well in the very uh, expressions the two expressions given to you you are going to choose the f last expression to be written as the first one which is afterward from this is you have to keep it in the mind otherwise the question will go wrong so taking the last term first we are going to write it 6a square minus 3a5 plus 2a4 plus 3a cube plus 8 this is the last expression in the twos and i am going to write it first because it is written after the word from this is the key point you have to uh, keep in mind while doing the subtractions of polynomials once you are done with the first uh, last expression to be written as first copy down this second expression mm, just uh, focus on the categories the terms as done in the uh, previous video so a4 over here we will write a4 with a positive sign then a cube over here minus a cube we will write minus 3 a cube then a5 over here with positive 4 we will write positive 4 a5 a square that is with minus 6 a square and uh, a4 already done a5 already done nothing left so we will write put a 0 over here with the positive sign now make a line put the subtraction sign second thing you need to keep in mind that you are going to put this minus sign which will change the whole signs of the last term written over here okay minus sign will change the whole thing minus sign will change its minus is here so it will be plus it is plus so it will be minus it is plus it will be minus it is negative it is it will be positive and no change over here if you want you can write that uh, no change will be there now add or subtract whatever you can call it you will plus 6 and plus 6 it will give you 12 a square minus 3 minus 4 it will give you minus 7 sign of a greater number a5 minus 2 oh sorry positive 2 minus 1 it will be positive 1 a4 it will be plus 3 plus 3 it will be plus 6 a cube and 8 minus 0 it will be positive 8 this is the answer for the vertical method we have obtained from the vertical method all right what i have done let me give you the explanation briefly first of all you have to focus on the expressions then what you have to do is to consider this from word then you pick up the expression written just after the from word you will write it as first then you will copy down the second expression then very next important uh, point over here is to write the minus sign minus sign will definitely make you change the sign of the last expression if it is minus it will become positive and so and so forth so then apply uh, the minus and plus sign um, uh, method minus minus plus and minus plus 
uh, minus so it will be uh, goes like this same sign always give you negative sorry positive and uh, alternate sign will give you negative when you multiply such in such a way these two operation will give you different results okay so in this manner <coughs> you will ob obtain this answer now we are moving towards the horizontal method once we are done with the vertical method you apply it you do the this uh, example and uh, if you have any kind of question you can leave it in the comment box let's move on to the horizontal method okay so i have written the expression over here with the brackets with the negative sign over here then in this uh, is, is the presentation for the horizontal method now what we are going to do we are deduce this minus sign inside the after uh, das bracket uh, again i have done what i have done for the subtraction i have picked up the last expression just written after the from word and i have written it as first okay then i have put a minus sign and the la, uh, first expression over here kahani khatam now what you are going to do is to write a 6a square minus 3a5 plus 2a4 then it will be 3a cube plus sin 8 now minus will introduce inside and every term will change its uh, sign to the new one so minus it will be plus minus plus minus a4 minus minus plus 6a square minus minus plus 3a cube minus plus minus 4a5 let's check again minus plus minus 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 plus minus minus plus minus plus and minus okay end of the chapter now next thing is that you have to category wise write it this is a square and a square it will give you 12 square but first of all you need to write it so that it will be easy for you to understand and comprehend here i have uh, arranged them and i have written over here for you five category the degree of fourth the degree of cube then square and then the constant number so we are going to consider all the coefficients first minus minus it will be plus so it will be 4 with minus sign 7 minus 3 and minus 4 it will give you minus of 7 a5 then it will be 2 minus 1 it will be positive 1 a4 then cube will be 3 plus 3 it will be plus 6 a cube then it will be a square and a square it will be 6 a square and 6 a square will give you 12 a square and the last one is alone the 8 so if you just check this out you have written it in the category wise form the 5 4 3 2 1 an arranged manner theek hai na so here the jumbled manner uh, you can see that 12a square se minus 7a5 a4 with positive sign 6a cube uh, with the positive sign and positive sign with uh, 8 over here the same uh, answer you have obtained with both the methods that is the vertical and the horizontal this is how you can perform this subtraction manner in polynomial expressions if you have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box if you have any uh, request for the uh, for any of the topic i can make you understand i can give you the explanation just uh, inform me in the comment write it there and then and i will uh, provide you as soon as possible inshallah taala take care allah hafiz